Hi everyone, we are here with Super Grandmaster from Ukraine, Evgeny Miroschinenko. He is here with us in uh, Kolkata. So Miro, Miro, just Miro. That's okay. that, that's good. I mean, I'm better known like this. Okay. So Miro, tell us how was your first day with the Kolkata Kids? Uh, well, it wasn't that easy, right? Uh, I mean, the the team, the simultaneous we played, it was well. It's a little bit pity we we, we ran out of time, but. It is an interesting experience. Uh, what especially is interesting that you have like very, very little kids. And, you know, usually when someone brings a little kids to simultaneous, you think, okay, these are, they, they are very, very big. They are very, very big, but they're not. I mean, <laughs> some of them, I mean, some of them are big, but there is one boy, which I don't know who, how old he is. He's playing very decent chess for his age. And yeah. It's a pity that uh, not a lot of people could come, but I hope next time, if, if we make it next time, and or maybe even tomorrow, uh, it will be more. So generally, it looks like a very high chess culture in India, because uh, I was told, like, my, say, main students, right, the grandmasters, that they could be recognized on the street. So, which is... So, is this your first visit to India? Uh, not exactly. It's my first visit uh, to India as the coach, because as the player in 2009, I was playing in uh, Mumbai, Mumbai Open, I guess, yeah, and shared first place. Even, even, there, were, there were times when I could still play chess. <laughs> shared first place with Humpy and some other, some other people. So, that's second, yeah, that's second visit. You do commentary at all uh, strong tournaments. So how easy or difficult it is to do commentary? How difficult it is to do commentary? Uh, well, once again, it depends on how you do it. Sometimes you... Yeah, well, first of all, it has to be said that I'm trying not to use or practically not using an engine. Yeah, so that's that's maybe is different compared to some what some other guys doing. So I say a lot of stupid things. Obviously, if you can no, do not consult the computer, you will be blundering during the analysis. But at the same time, I'm trying to give like you know a human approach to the position. So what what is this guy who is on your screen, not me, but the player? What he's thinking about, right? Because the engine immediately says, okay, Rook C1 plus plus two, that's, that's it. Yeah, so I'm trying to give the human approach to those positions, so how the players are thinking, how they pick the moves. I'm getting used to that, yes, but it is, it is hard, especially if the position is complicated, yes, and you have to, normally you have to take your time and think. As the chess player, my inner chess player says, don't tell anything before you calculate what is going on, but when you are on air, you, on air, you always have to tell something. So here comes, uh, fr from this point, that, so some mistakes are coming. But in general, I like the, I enjoy this. I enjoy this, like explaining what's going on and so on. It, it's a different I would not say that it's easier than playing chess, in a way, in a way, but it's a different kind of tension, right? So here you have to be awake and uh, talk for many, many hours, but you're not that much responsible for the result of the moves you are making. Player, coach or commentator and video, which one do you prefer the most? Mm, well, I used to, I think I used to feel best in my life. Uh, you know, when I was a player, when the first time I won the Ukrainian Championships, I was like 25 years of age and I was very serious about becoming like a top player. But that's maybe because I was young. <laughs> so I, I really, uh, as for now, I do try to play chess from time to time, but it's, it's terrible, I, I can tell you. I mean, I'm still not that bad, but the feeling compared to those, you know, like really the moment when I was in form and everything, it, it doesn't really uh, leave you with a good feeling. So for now, yeah, commentary and coaching, coaching intelligent people, if I'm allowed to put it this way. Because, yeah, I really like uh, the way it was here. Uh, that people came and they are asking questions, they are really interested in what you are telling them. So that's, that's, I think that's it. So I, I would not separate, it's one, the other and the third all together. So a little bit of playing, coaching and, and without the commentary, yeah, the life would be boring as well. So I, as you can see, I like to talk. <laughs> yeah, without a shadow of doubt and you talk so well. So are we going to see an author, uh, Miro, anytime soon? Oh, you mean the book? Yeah, yeah there have been some ideas, but um, 
not not say let's not uh, not in the nearest future let's put it this way yeah i do have some ideas on what i can tell people it's it's i don't i don't want really to make you know just just another opening book because i'm not that good at openings and i could do something but i don't feel like it's my it will be my real contribution i do have some ideas what i can write about but yeah it has to take it will take some time yeah. what's next for you after this india after india well uh, not yet sure i mean there are training camps here and there and even in moscow i'm i'm working online as well yeah in the moscow when i'm where i'm based i also have some some students so but major events well looking forward to comment on olympia but i'm not yet officially invited i mean i've been told that i will be there but i'm not yet officially invited so i'm sure you will definitely be invited over there because we would love to hear your commentary during the olympiad games before we leave one last question i have for you you yeah. have two secret students over here we got to know so would you like to reveal their names uh, secret students well i don't know kolkata this city yeah uh this i mean maybe let's make it like a little quiz so two guys who are not yet grandmasters right or one of them is, i mean I'm, this is some coffee no no one I, i was about to say the name one of them is <laughs> okay and the other one he is not a grandmaster yet but he's definitely he has the strength of a grandmaster so he's not the grandmaster on the list very young very talented very promising players who i believe have the potential okay i will so far give it a shot like 2650 and then i will be happy to be wrong like not setting it high enough and look for the names yourself guys thank you for speaking with us in the i wish you all the best okay always always a pleasure